lab. They are still trying to get him help. Uh, we told you they had attempted uh, an intervention, which did not work. He rejected that. So he was says, furious. Not going to any rehab. So now they're trying a more gentle, uh, loving approach. Yeah, so the other, um, you know, of course, Chloe and all the Kardashians were trying. So now his other side of his family, his immediate family, we're told, um, is basically saying that we're going to say, oh, you know what? We love you a lot. We support you and just try the whole I love you technique and think that to show him that way that he'll end up changing his mind. I don't understand that because the, because interventions are all based on love. It's just right. some love is tougher than others, but it's all rooted in love. It's all so rooted in love. Not, if he's not going to deal with the Kardashians with whom he really bonds, then why would he Why would he deal with a more gentle approach? Well, maybe, maybe, maybe it's good cop, bad cop. No, but he has kids and other people who also could possibly get to him in that situation if they're like, oh, okay, you know what? I'm just using them as an example. Like, he has two, you know, a son and a daughter. If they'd be like, oh, daddy, you know what? Like, I really need you. We love you a lot. Like, please do this for us. Will you do it? Then it's good cop, bad cop. If, if, if the Kardashians were attempting a more like you know traditional intervention where it's tough love uh, and then you have the other his immediate family comes in and they do uh, you know not so tough love and they're the, they're the good cops so then maybe he goes along with what the good cops are saying. yeah I, I gotta say I don't I mean, know Lamar, not, Lamar Odom you know this is just such an example of how horrible a drug problem is right. and how some people can't be saved and I hope I hope Lamar can because he's really a good guy and he, you know there are some people it just doesn't work it just doesn't work and they have tried everything with him hey guys this is Vivian in Dallas and you know what where there is life there is hope and they just have to keep going for it with Lamar I'm so glad to see that he has so many family members and friends who really want to help fight for him and who want to help him fight for himself so you know what do you do as long as he's alive as long as there's hope you keep trying because you just can't give up on the people that you love and I hope that he loves himself enough to give it a try and really kick this thing because yeah. there are obviously a lot of people that love him. You're right. You're right. You're right. Uh, let's uh, 